Sir, there is an incoming message. It is from the Warbird. On screen. Hi, sir. Captain, you seem to be in a very unfortunate circumstance. How can we help? Are you responsible for this? I'm not sure. We were conducting some geological experiments on the surface of the asteroid. It is entirely possible that we accidentally sealed you in. If only we had known you were beneath the surface, if you had shared your plans with us, this might have been avoided. What do you want, Cyril? I don't want anything, Captain, but I will offer to help you. How? By transporting your crew aboard my ship. We'll take you back to Romulus, where, after a short stay as our guests, you will be returned to the Federation. Thank you for your generous offer. I will take it under advisement. As you wish. We will be continuing our research in this system for a while longer. I await your decision. We can't do it. If we abandon the Enterprise, they'll come back here and get their hands on both ships. Agreed. Options. Captain. I believe we could use the phasers to cut our way out. The asteroid's internal structure is highly unstable. Any attempt to cut through the rock could cause the entire chasm to collapse. Captain, I have a suggestion. There's a piece of equipment in Admiral Pressman's quarters under guard that might get us out of here. It's a prototype for a Federation cloaking device. You just ended your career, Will. That's what it's about. A cloaking device. In the Treaty of Algeron, the Federation specifically agreed not to develop cloaking technology. And that treaty is the biggest mistake we ever made. It's kept us from exploiting a vital area of defense. That treaty has kept us in peace for 60 years. And as a Starfleet officer, you're supposed to uphold it. Now that's enough! I'm taking command of this vessel. Mr. Worf, escort the captain to his quarters. I don't think anyone's going to come to your defense this time. How do we use the cloak to escape from the asteroid? It's more than just a cloak. It changes the structure of matter, in theory. A ship using this device could pass through normal matter. I see why you were so eager to find it. And can't you see the potential here? The phasing cloak could be the greatest breakthrough in weapons research in the last 50 years. Except that it's illegal. It's in violation of an agreement that the Federation signed in good faith. Captain, I think we could adapt the cloak for the Enterprise. Mr. Data. Theoretically, it is possible, sir. But it would take several hours to study the device and determine how to link it to our systems. Make it so. 